Hi, I'm Julia Dobbins, Director of Programs and Services for the National Institute for Medical Respite Care. Today, we are thrilled to share with you our newest publication, Recommendations for Outcome Measures and Data Collection Practices for Medical Respite Programs. In the spring of 2019, the Council began convening a learning collaborative of 10 medical respite programs. The focus of this learning collaborative was on how medical respite programs are determining their outcome measures. What data are they collecting and why? Who do they choose to share that data with and why? And also how respite programs are using their data and outcomes to demonstrate value and build community partnerships. What we learned from this year long learning collaborative is that the integrity of a medical respite program rests in their ability to provide meaningful and quality services to a complex population. Their sustainability, though, lies in the extent to which they're able to demonstrate that ability. Clearly defined outcome measures and data collection protocols are imperative to help programs tell the story of how their services positively impacted the lives of their clients. The recommendations we're sharing with you today are meant to serve as a foundation on which medical respite programs can build their practice. They do not, however, encompass all that happens with a client during a medical respite stay. Self-management, goal setting, trust in the healthcare system, relationship building, these are all examples of the philosophy of care of medical respite that can be difficult to quantify and measure. We know that not every victory in medical respite fits neatly into an outcome measure or into a box that you can check. So we encourage you as you approach your work on outcomes and data to do so with creativity, with flexibility, and ensuring that you're always centering the experience and the needs of your clients. I hope this resource is helpful. If you have questions or wanna talk more about outcomes and data, please feel free to reach out. Thank you so much.